Shout out to Always Relevant TV. You know we're always relevant. DJ Scott High, baby. You know vibes. My name is Scotty Too Hotty with the body, and I'm here with Always Relevant TV, and we are at the Zoo's premiere for Baddies West. Yeah. This is Razor Behavior. Shout out to Always Relevant TV. Thank you so much. Hey y'all, it's your girl China with Always Relevant TV. It's 2023, and I'm at our first event of the year, the Baddies West season premiere. Now we're gonna talk to the baddies, ask them what the season is given, and why y'all should tune in. Make sure y'all keep it locked. Okay, we had the Baddies West premiere, but we got an OG bad girl, Miss Cat Washington. In the building, girl. Okay. Now, tell me about some growth from Bad Girls Club to Baddies West. Like, how have you grown? You gonna see. It's night and day. I went from a psycho, little wild young bitch to like, can't y'all just talk about it? I mean, you can smack the bitch later, but can we talk about it first? You know what I mean? So, there's growth. There's a lot of growth. Now, if you could say one song describes the season, what would the song be? Ooh. Ooh, that's a good one. Bitch, I might be stumped. Um, I don't know. Anything drill at this point. Anything drill? Anything drill. Maybe some Asian doll, bitch, because <laughs> lashes, eyebrows, motherfucking edges, the, 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 the little tips, the braids been on the floor, wigs. Everybody all bitch. Have a so it's serious. Girl. Real serious. Entertainment. You're going to love it. Everybody brought it. Okay, where can people just follow up with you and just keep in tapped in with what you got going on? Oh, I got everything going on. I'm a serial entrepreneur, so at this point, I'm doing everything from yachts to clothing brands to I have a bunch of storefronts, event spaces. I've been kind of hustling these past couple years, so I've been on my grind. Okay, well, we love it. Yeah, but um, at MSCAT215 is my Instagram and avoidcouture.com. Okay, thank you. Yacht group, bitch. Come run a yacht from a bitch, please. Period. <laughs> So I seen you on the audition and you came so different from the other girls. You was yes. just about your business. So just break it down for people that's not familiar, like, because I know you're a boss. Yes, I own three businesses. It's very hard. So I wanted to get on here and do a business move. Not only put on for my entrepreneurs, all my boss ladies, letting you know you don't have to come on the show to act the fool. But if you have to, do what you got to do. And I hear that Baltimore accent. <laughs> DC actually. Oh, DC, let me correct because it's a difference. It's a difference. But what do you want people to see from you just being on the show? Like, I just want y'all to say, step out on faith. Do what you have to do. Sometimes you got to walk away from your business to actually see what else is out there. Different opportunities might happen for me. So I'm excited. Okay, okay. So we are just, you know, just sending you a lot of love and just wait to see you on the show. Thank you, baby. I appreciate it. We at the Baddies West from here. We got Biggie. Leave me away, mommy. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I just want to say, between you and Rolly, y'all was holding it down for the thick girls, okay? okay. Get, get into the material. Okay, but I know you were a boss before. You, you was talking about that on the, you know, the auditions, but just tell them how you really came through this season. No, absolutely. I came through as a businesswoman, as I'm supposed to, executing the things the right way. No arguments that are not supposed to be unnecessary. You know what I'm saying? No unnecessary bullshit. You know what I'm saying? You pop off, there's a time and place for everything. Period. Yeah. All right, so if you could pick a song that describes your mood for tonight, what would it be? Quítate de tu que llegó la caballota, la perra, la viva, la potra. I don't know what she said, but it sounds like some lit shit. I don't know. Y'all know Evie Queen, shout out to my bitch. Love it. Um, no, but I'm so, I'm so excited. You know what I'm saying? Today, really, the song that's going through my head is... Um, La perra, la viva, la potra. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Evie Queen. There's nobody in my way, you know what I'm saying? And that's, that, that's just what it is. That's that on that, period. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm good. Okay, so, you know, we got the lady in red. What's okay. the vibes this season for the show? You know, very soft, very gentle, very mind your business, you know, stay in your lane. That's the vibes. Okay, okay. Now, which, how have you changed from last season to this season? You know, I keep getting that question, and it's just, I came in very halfway, so I wasn't my, I was myself, but I couldn't give all of me, because I didn't really know the girls this season. I can really know the girls, bond with the girls, get to know everybody in a way, so you can see more of me. The same me, but more of me, if that makes sense. Okay, okay. And if you could pick one song that describes the whole show, what would you say? God. There's so many songs. Pick one, a good I'm one. I'm not good with song names. Well, you can wrap it on Future. Okay. Future. Okay. He's toxic. Just pick a song that's toxic. 
<laughs> so it's giving toxic. It's giving very toxic, very rowdy, very. Does Future and Megan have a song together? Pressurelicious. They're... Maybe that one. <laughs> I'm sorry, Serious. I don't know song names. I'm All sorry. right, we at the Baddies West premiere. We got Sky. Always relevant. That's what you got to know. Okay, period. So, you know, you. what can we expect to see from you in this season? A lot of good music. Me DJing, having a good time. Me and Rock, me and Nat, me and the girls, having a blast. You know, good vibes. Okay, so how long have you been DJing and what's like one of the hardest parts about your field? Um, I've been DJing for almost 10 years now. I actually just got back from Tokyo like a couple hours ago. I was DJing out there and, oh, sorry. Um, the hardest part about uh, my field is like going into a new space and just being able to take over the room, which I do, but like you have to like have the right equipment. Sometimes like I have to bring my own equipment as a woman, you know, I'm like lugging around shit like a man. You know, that type of shit, making sure all my shit's together. Sometimes I don't get to party because I still got my laptop in my hand. But nevertheless, always setting the vibes. You know vibes. Hey, now, we know you know the vibes. We know you know music. And if you could pick one song that describes the season, what would the song be? I'm in my bag. I'm in my toughie. Dripping designer. Shoes to Giuseppe. This dress look good because I'm in it. <laughs> that one. Period. <laughs>